Baptist Health is rolling out two new ambulances, bringing a new level of care to all our Kansans. And tonight's Health Matters report, Claire Kreit shows us how this will help save the lives of the most critical patients. Door secured. Sirens on. A new kind of ambulance is hitting the streets of the natural state to care for some of the most critical patients. From heart attacks or from chronic heart disease, uh, from lung failure, and people that uh, have severe trauma. Baptist Health Transplant Institute Program Director Dr. John Ransom says this ambulance takes everything you'd find in an ICU and puts it on the road. In this ambulance we can use ECMO, which is a, a system that fully supports heart or lung function. We can use uh, impellas that uh, assist the heart and uh, ventilators which breathes for people and all that at the same time. From the equipment to who's sitting in the back taking care of the patient. A over six years. This transports four healthcare professionals including a physician, a perfusionist to run the pump, an assistant to them and an ICU nurse. We can change medications, we can change the flow of the device as we move along, and whatever is necessary can be done as we, during that transfer period. Dr. Ransom says this ambulance helps stop the clock until they can get the patient to the hospital. And it allows us to go out anywhere in the state and bring people to this center where we can provide the services that can't be provided otherwise. Raising the level of care for all our Kansans. We will be able to save a lot of lives around the state. Claire Kreitz reporting $175,000 in donations from the Wingate Charitable Foundation and Trinity Foundation were used to buy the ambulances.